Uh, guys, I did something stupid. I did something um, suboptimal, to say the least. I just wanted to go live on the More Loco YouTube channel. I accidentally went live on Loco TV for eight minutes. There was a timer on the screen. That's all I had. And then I shut it down because I panicked a little bit. And then, uh, yeah, now uh, there's like 200 people uh, sitting there like... Um, yeah, anyways. <clears throat> a little bit awkward, a little bit strange. I have since deleted the settings that I usually use for the in, in OBS for going live on my second channel. Algorithm ruined, bro. Absolutely, I can't fucking believe this. Anyways, it is what it is. It's an eight minute count up. Hope you guys had a nice weekend. It is up first. It's more popular, not really. You'd imagine that the channel with more subscribers would be the one that shows up first. It's more popular? Not really, though. That is pretty wild. Uh, let's see. So you're saying... Okay, I'm incognito right now. Loco. Oh, yeah. More Loco pops up before Loco TV. That is pretty wild. Interesting. You'd imagine that the channel with more subscribers would be the one that shows up first. It's more popular? Not really, though. Hmm, okay. What about if we search StarCraft? Does it show my videos? Who's the f- Winter? Ah, oh, for fuck's sake. Get him out of here. Report video. How do we report the video? Get out of here. Gosh, Oppenheimer, but it's not on American Netflix. Do you have a solution? Computer or your laptop? Fine. No, I know. I know you don't. Norwegian. You sound like airplane. Wait, this is. I gotta tell you, there's gotta be at least a few Finnish people watching. Like Sarah, obviously, hangs out on my channel all the time to get the freshest. Not play Kuma. I think I now know most Finnish. This is why I can't hear the stream. Wait, this is... You're on the runway! You're not supposed to... What's going on? Okay, I know you're an airplane mechanic, right? That would probably explain it. I don't recommend working on a running airplane. I think... I think you should shut down the engine first. And then... You... Work on it. I... I don't... Just testing... What? Is this like... Yeah, it's like Batman! Lazy links. I have no idea what. No. Echo Soldier has never done me wrong. <sighs> Anyways, anything good going on in the StarCraft 2 subreddit today, guys? Let's see. Scouting by rank. This is a high effort meme. Somebody even drew. Ha! I knew you were on the other side of the map. Gotcha. Silver League scouting. Gold League Scouting. Found you. Now to use all 45 of my APM to harass your SCV. I honestly don't know why I'm not Grandmaster. Floating 1600 minerals. No workers made for 30 seconds. Forgot gas. Forgot expansion. Probes relate next to the minerals instead of on the minerals. Never scouted enemies gas. Wait, this last one is a little out of place. This last one is a little bit of a... Uh, this is a Platinum League moment right here. I think the, the maker of this meme is... Anyways. Uh, Platinum League. It's Cybercore before Nexus. What do I do? I cancel building CC, build four bunkers, cut worker production, cancel 99% done factory to build eBay, restart the factory. Opponent does not have a real build order, just expands right after the SCV leaves. Diamond League. I see your starport. I won't lose leaves. Diamond League. I see your starport. I won't lose to that. Now I'll just not scout again until your two base all in is destroying my third. I'll be masters in no time. And then masters. Ha! Huh. I knew exactly what you're doing, but I'm not going to respond to it properly because I saw Bjorn hold off Roach Ravager with one Hellion and three Marines. Very nice. Why? What, 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 what is that on the... Why, why does he have a red, de uh, red dot on the desk? What's going on there? Also, these are left-handed gamers. Ha! Huh. Left-handed gamers? Who uses their fucking... Who... Who uses their fucking... Uses their fucking...
Fucking. These people are using their mouse with the left hand. No wonder they can't climb out of gold. I think that's that's the reason why. You forgot my scout. I look at your base and completely ignore what I see. Very nice. Winning a premier tournament, despite being the only player of the race in the round of eight. How many did... That is a very specific... Oh, I actually thought it was... I'm not sure why we're... Ooh. Rounding out my Terran air units, the science vessel and the cloaked wraith. Oh, I actually thought it was just going to be an empty photo. <laughs> I think I said... Okay. Nah, this is fair. I thought it was just... Very cool. The picture of air. Mm -mm -mm -mm. If the intended goal to the dark... Bro, that is an upgrade that was added. Hey. Yeah, this change was roughly two years ago. Okay. However, Dark Templar, it still effectively accomplishes the same thing. Oh, it's Heaven Starcraft. Okay. okay. Uh, improvements to five players struggling with. The problem I had with it is that it's just so focused on minor number changes rather than. Hey, we're eight. So, what? Well, players that. But these are actually significant. They are actually right. Yeah. Now you just need to get it. Okay, oh, that's man. Everybody, Eisenhower. <laughs> that's so funny, man. Taken by the corruption. Translate. Serral shouldn't be number two, man. Number two in team. Okay. Anything else? Serral being number two in Team Liquid makes national news in Finland. <laughs> oh no, what? Oh, for fuck's sake. Oh, for fuck's sake. Oh, for fuck's sake. Serral shouldn't be number two, man. Ok. Yo, Nasatala. That's yeah no. Uh, do I do, do trans translate? Show translate option. Translate to English. Sites. The internet was shocked. Came second on the list of respected sites. The internet was shocked. Bro, we got we got a Finnish clickbait article. Many felt that the wrong name was raised over Satala. All right, Michael Meisenhower of Team Liquid. Thinks are ten with number one side has listed what he thinks are ten of the greatest StarCraft players of all time. Eisenhower's in-depth article, bro. I like how this Eisenhower guy came out of nowhere. I never heard anybody ever talk about Eisenhower. This guy, this guy, sound... <laughs> this guy could be a scientist. For all, I have no idea what he does. This is just a dude with like four Twitter followers. Yeah, he has a bunch of random posts on on Team Liquid. And he like made this very long fucking post and some made this very long fucking long post and somehow maybe it's me, dude. <sighs> Open hammer. Sup? Yo, what's up, Ryu? Uh, the top spot was taken by the Korean Maru. The top spot was taken by the Korean Maru by a minimal margin ahead of the Finnish star. <laughs> uh, the Koreans in bold, number one position. Uh, the Koreans. <laughs> the Koreans in bold. Number one position is justified by more than 10 years of long-term success and seven GSL CODES championships. I like how they took this photo of... <laughs> That's so funny. That's so funny, man. Like, they're not straight up, you know, being mean to Maru and disagreeing, but they are definitely... If you read between the lines, it's pretty obvious. <laughs> My god. 
They got some articles over here too. It's so funny. This is great. The publication in question is a tabloid? Ah, and like it was- Ah, alright. Yeah, no, I figured, man. Like it was definitely a little, uh... Kind of like the Daily Mail in the UK. I don't know what the Daily Mail is. The New York Post in the US? Okay. I'm not sure. Imagine having a list so bad it makes tabloid news. Yeah. <laughs> When's Sarah going to the military? I think in like two weeks. I think it's set like mid-April. Something like that. Do you think tabloids will publish Loco's vegetable tier list? Well, well, my vegetable tier list was perfect. So I don't really see the problem. Life's huge gambling spree after I am Katowice 2014? Really? So after SOS won 100,000? Oh my god, who's this? You don't recall the name? We've gone around in circles. That's, that's a lot of money. Yeah. Is banned in Korea. Basically. Yeah, it's crazy. Playing Carol hasn't. And so, you know, it's also weird, man. Playing 1v1s from the car. I Problem. Playing 1v1s from the car I live in. Ah, oh, yeah, I saw this one, bro. Look. <laughs> this is such a sad photo. This is a weird photo, too. Um, so this guy, this is probably your average 2v2 slash 3v3 teammate, okay? When you, when you solo queue in StarCraft 2, this is probably the guy you queue up with. So this guy is living out of a Tesla. This is a Tesla, a Model 3. Playing with a Bluetooth keyboard. He's a car, a Bluetooth keyboard. He's watching on the screen of the car. Screen of the car. A podcast? God, that is a very large American flag. And then we have, I don't know, I don't think it's a MacBook. It's not a MacBook. It's a, it's a Windows laptop. It's a very American photo. Yeah, it's, but it's kind of sad, man. Why is this man living in a car? You thought it was a pizza? No, I don't think it's a pizza, man. No, I don't think it's a pizza, man. It was a pizza? No, I don't think it's... It does look like a dill, yeah. I think he says in the post, so I was, I was reading about this. Quite a nice San Francisco place you got there. Do you mind sharing your real estate agent's number? Oh no. Imagine losing to a guy like this. Yeah, I think he said he was going through a divorce. So it's kind of sad, really. Peak USA. This guy probably could support two families in Europe. Say, this guy probably could support two families in Europe, but prefers to spend his money to go to the dentist once in a lifetime. <clears throat> this is not a very good American threat right over here. Okay, this this is a this is a very harsh Reddit threat. Car payment is five hundred dollars. Apartment is seventeen hundred dollars minimum. It does seem weird to me. Minimum. It does seem weird to me, and I don't really want to get into the argument here, to own a luxury car but not a place to live. That seems, you know, that seems a bit funky. But hey, if he wants to live life like that, and it's his choice, whatever. <sighs> Let's see. <laughs> Bro, why, why does, where do you even get a flag like that? What? <laughs> this man, look, look at... What? <laughs> this man, look... look This man And look, look at the size of that flag. That was a big flag. Oh yeah, yeah. Those are common flags, Loco. Flag. Those are common flags, Loco. You just get it at Walmart? Like anywhere? Is it common to hang a flag up on a wall? Because I feel like I've seen this many times, especially in podcasts. Do lots of people just have a wall with a giant American flag on it? Yeah? Interesting. I've never seen that over here. It's Republicans mainly?
Oh, well, it was very common to see a lot of Dutch flags a couple years ago while there uh, were a lot of drama, especially with farmers. Basically what they would do, probably the most disrespectful thing you can do to any country's flag, right, is fly it upside down. So you would like drive past these fields and there would just be flag after flag after flag of Dutch flag upside down. So usually it goes red, white, blue, but it went blue, white, red. And there's still a bunch of places here that have them up. So there's loads and loads and loads of, uh, there were loads and loads and loads of flags that were upside down in the Netherlands. Yeah. This was uh, due to emissions and all that. And uh, they basically got their ways in the end. But anyways, it worked. Yeah, apparently it worked. How's the Nexit buzz? No, there's no Nexit, man. The farmer party went hard. Yeah. Yeah. Would it be more disrespectful to turn it 90 degrees to look like a French flag? Yes. Although people would just be confused. <laughs> that would just make it weird. <laughs> uh, it's sweet and you couldn't notice, I guess, if you had it upside down. That's a good point. So wait, if you guys watch, like, if you see this, for Americans in the chat, you immediately assume political affiliation just because of a flag that's hung up on a wall? Like, immediately? Ha. Huh. Interesting. Hmm. Okay. You're like, oh god, I know oh god, what's going on here? Alright, I see. You don't, Loco? No. Honestly... Honestly, I don't really follow American politics very much, though, so... I'm not sure. Although, I would assume if I see somebody flying a, a Dutch flag upside down, I can assume their political, you know, affiliation, right? It is, uh, yeah. Pretty clear at that point. Oh my god. Oh my god. HyperX meetup with Team AEG at PAX East? Dude, I love this so much. I love that the guys from HyperX were like, yo, everybody hold a stick of RAM and we'll take a photograph. <laughs> yeah, this is Demu with hair. So they're all like standing there with their RAM stick. <laughs> So they're all like standing there with their ram stick. <laughs> so they're all like standing there. Funny. They all have a different one too, which is kind of hilarious. They all have a different kind of ram. Yeah. <sighs> the truth nobody wants to accept. I, like you, am someone who enjoys playing, watching, and consuming all the game we all enjoy related to this beautiful game we all enjoy bro you're immediately wrong nobody actually plays the game anymore okay everybody just watches but anyways personally it goes as far back as watching Clazart cast brute war vods on youtube and it all took off from there we played slash watched through every nonsensical and imbalanced era from brute lord infester to swarm host and early heart of the swarm to mass ravens i mean the list could go on space period period Everyone needs to realize how absolutely insane it is that a balanced quote-unquote council consisting of pro players whose very livelihoods depends on them winning prize money gets to dictate the balance of the game, space period. That is a massive conflict of interest, a situation in which a person in position to derive personal benefit from actions or decisions made in their official capacity, space period. Sure, we would all like to believe that this quote-unquote council has the longevity, space comma, balance and popularity of the game in mind when it comes up, or when coming up with these balance changes, but it has been pretty obvious that they don't. The whole system of letting pro players dictate the balance of the game is absolutely bonkers and really needs to be revised. Yeah, I, I, don't, I, I don't necessarily disagree. It's just, um, who's gonna do it? <laughs> <laughs> Who's gonna do it? <laughs> what are the alternatives? Do you want one guy to be in charge? I don't know, man. A coalition of random amateurs? No, 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 no. We should put Meisenhower in charge. <laughs> Somebody get Meisenhower for this shit, man. Meisenhower for this shit. For this shit. For this shit, man, 
Meisenhower has got a good understanding. He understands how important the GSO code S is. No, we're, I still have to start with generals. Sorry, I'll start with generals in a moment. <clears throat> I'll do it. I'll balance StarCraft 2. Half the Reddit community would immediately do it. Bro, half the Reddit community is clueless. I still feel thankful. I actually think the Balance Council is doing a pretty good job overall, to be honest. A good solution would, might be to give this role to pro casters and not the pro players. I am definitely not balancing the game, mate. You think I want to become David Kim 2.0? You think I want to have the blame? No, 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 no. I'm sure there are enough casters that would like that. I think I could do a decent job, but I, I just don't want to have that. Sounds like a job for AI. Yeah, maybe we should. Let Artosis do the balance. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's put Winter in charge. I have seen Winter put his balance notes up on the internet in the past. Even Pig, who's on the balance council, admits he had to step away for a while because he doesn't have enough time for it recently on his stream. So to answer your question, some of them already are. A caster council with pro player advisory committee? Bro, it's also insane though, right? Which caster would actually be qualified? I could only think of maybe Rotterdam. The thing is, man, everybody, everybody is slightly biased. I'm sure that if Rotterdam were to be in charge of balance, he would try really hard to not be biased. Because, you know, he's a great commentator. He understands the game really well. But he would always be slightly biased towards Protoss. Like, I, at that point, you will have people that are like, okay, so the caster Protoss. Like, I, at that point, you will have people that are like, okay, so the caster council, right? There's four Terrans, there's six Protoss players, and there's two Zerks. No wonder we get all these Protoss buffs. Like, <laughs> there's, there's, there's a lot of overcorrecting for sure if Reddit would be in charge. I don't know, man. I, it's not a bad idea to put on more casters. The thing is, it's kind of a shitty job. Shitty job. The thing is, it's kind of a shitty. Job. I actually think the Balance Council is doing a good job. I think a lot of Protoss players could do more to be competing at the highest level. I genuinely don't think Protoss has been, you know effectively used like Terran and Zerg have been at the absolute highest level. I really think it would be a massive change if Max Pax would play offline tournaments. I really think if uh, Zest, for example, came back, because I think he, he about wrapped up his military service by now. If Zest came, like there's so many little things that could make a massive difference. Yeah, like the strongest protos in the world right now is not playing offline events. Like I genuinely think if you can figure out a way to fucking get Max Pax to play to fucking get Figure out a way to, to fu fucking get max packs to play offline tournaments. I don't know what it takes, but like, <laughs> you know, it's not possible. No, it is not possible, Barabas. You cannot have a balanced meta where everybody is happy. It's a thankless job by default. Thank you for the seven months. Just a person or a group completely outside of StarCraft. Just a person or a group completely outside of StarCraft 2 that don't know anything about it. They analyze last year's tournaments and feedback and do the changes. Somebody who doesn't understand the game. A council of people that don't know the game should do balance. That's no. <laughs> no, bro. Stetsa style seems to do quite well. Owls versus Zero. I actually think Protoss versus Zerg is totally fine. I think Protoss versus Zerg may actually be slightly Protoss favorite right now. I wouldn't be surprised. But Protoss versus Terran is definitely a little trickier. I think Protoss versus Zerg is totally fine. Yeah. The only thing is that you have to kind of defend, honestly. But, like, it's hard to say, honestly. But, you know, the, the shitty thing, right? The shitty thing about Protoss versus Zerg.
the shitty th the shit the shit the, the shitty thing anything about protos versus zerk i think if you were to do a best of three between the highest ranked zerk and the highest ranked protos right say a best of three serol up against max Bax or serol up against hero whatever you consider to be the number one right best of three i think those protos players have about a maybe a 30 percent chance to win i think maybe yeah something like that a best of seven however i think they may have like a three percent chance to win I um I don't see anybody really taking down Sarah in a best of seven. The problem that Protos runs into is that you kind of need to trick your opponent a little bit. Like you kind of need to catch them off guard a bit, and it's very tricky to become like you, you need you need to figure out a way to reliably do that. And you could do it once and maybe twice in a best of three, but in a best of ser uh, best of seven is going to be very different. <sighs> Anyways, it is all yeah. I actually don't think I actually don't think it's all that significant really. I think very minor Yeah. I actually don't think I actually don't think it's all that I think very minor changes will go a very long way. I think the lack of more factions makes it harder. More factions you have to be more pronounced with. No, no, no. I remember you stopped playing for a few months because Skytos was so inbound on the ladder. Uh they they triple nerfed Void Rays. <laughs> to go it would be zerks and terrans are just another possibility slightly worse no yeah. another possibility and this is kind of like you know and then that it just could that be the case i don't know no. we don't really see protos when it because protos is entirely wrong aspect ratio and Luckily, my hackers do gain additional. I wonder if it's safe for me to do a. I can hack into the clean Sell the thing. None of this is as healthy as it once did, but fair. That's all you need to know. Did you just run out for a civilian? That's okay. Any way of capturing it without getting... I don't even know what I'm trying to do here. I forgot what my objective is here, but I don't... Did you just run out for a civilian? That's okay. Um, those were my hackers. <laughs> I emphasis on the word were. Yes. Okay. I suggest you guys do a little bit of that researching right about right over here. You know what? I'm not even gonna bother with Black Lotus. That was the Scott store. Lotus. That was the Scut Storm? Oh, that's the Scut Storm. Ah. I see. No, no, no. We, we put all of our eggs in one basket, guys. That's how we do things in real life. That's how we do things in the video game, too. You guys believe in splitting the risks? I think they need vision in order to cast it. So these guys are kind of like Zagara and the Heart of the Swarm campaign. They they lack vision. Hackers are insanely good. It's just that they are pretty expensive, but they they make their money back over time. These missions seem to be quite, you know. No, get out of the! Oh god. This is the Overlord. This is the Overlord tank. I wonder if this kills it. Oh, I don't even need that. Apparently, these guys can reach the high ground. Ah, a couple civilians. Okay, guys, finish that one off? No? Okay. Okay, I think I'm gonna run. 
Uh, I think I think that was an incantation that I just that one's on There's a sniper in the area. Suck the internet dry? Did he just say that? In hand. I'll suck the internet dry. I'll suck the internet. I'll suck. Good point. At least I didn't lose my structures this time around. There's a sniper in the area. I should have known that this was a dumb idea. Uh, I think I think that was an incantation that I just that one's on that one that one I should have known that this was a dumb idea. I shouldn't have spoken Dutch on stream. There's a sniper in the area. I just blast the entire area to bits. Have you considered that? At least I didn't lose my structures this time around. Good point. I'll suck the internet dry. I'll suck the internet dry. Did he just say that? Is that really something that wasn't a very obvious innuendo in 2003? Like, I'll suck, no, I'll, suck no internet internet I'll suck the internet dry? Did he just say that? Is that really something that wasn't a very obvious innuendo in 2003? Like, I, I don't... I, see, I don't know much, guys, but I feel like that was always a, a little bit dirty. Hello. There's a fucking sniper dude in that tower. Can, okay. can I, um, can I attack move with my... Really bad. Holy crap. It's a hard mission. Just, just go over here. You guys are sprinting loco uh, NFTs? Yeah, yeah, of course. Good morning. I recommend this in real life too, man. If you can figure out a way to never run out of cash in real life, I am just gonna keep making hackers. That seems like the best strategy in this game whenever you have options for it. Just not running out of cash. I got an email recently about one of my, uh... I think he's like a, a, a cousin of one of my uncles. I am just gonna keep making hackers. That seems like the best strategy in this game whenever you have options for it. Just not running out of cash. I recommend this in real life too, man. If you can figure out a way to never run out of cash in real life. I mean, I haven't found anything like it, but... I, can I got an email recently about one of my, uh... I think he's like a, a, a cousin of one of my uncles or something? Who is a Nigerian prince. So, I feel like I've just got that, you know, I, I'm just about to get that going in real life too, but... I recommend that for everybody. I can recommend. So there's a Scott Storms timer right over here, but I don't know what it is. I'm sure this time around it will work well. The Doomsday Clock has been sitting. Oh, you guys can't see the. It just says zero zero. Make in college. Laptop in hand. Meditation that I just. I think he's top down ability. To try and and drive down is a bit. Make another one of these war facts. Convoy sighted. <laughs> they have no idea we are here. They are entering the village, moving towards our ambush positions. Thank you, Argal. Moving away. Go now. Go 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 go. There you go, dude. Hope you enjoyed it. Masters! Ah, we can put the supplies to better use than the villagers? Real! Convoy sighted. Yeah. Convoy sighted. Supplies Go, go, go! Get the supplies! By Argal, please comply. Hope you enjoyed it. Yeah. We have civilians. Excellent time. We have finally liberated some more civilians. Excellent time for me to take their resources. Put their credit cards. The Rotter tank? 
It can scavenge enemy kills to... I'm gonna get it, whatever it does. We can put the supplies to better use than the villagers. <laughs> we can put the supplies to better use than the villagers? Really? Okay. Guys, we gotta we gotta use those yeah, the villagers, they're they're gonna fucking spend money on They're gonna fucking They're gonna fucking I gotta spend money on useless. I gotta spend money on useless things like food and clean water and like I, I don't know, dude. We we can make good use of it. Yeah, no, dude, we're we're gonna buy some Twitch subs with that money. Marauder tanks can scavenge enemy kills. You need to get to work. Alrighty. UN? Oh my god! <laughs> Alrighty. Another supply. Another supply convoy has been sighted here. The UN? Oh my god! <laughs> this is so screwed! <laughs> Nice, I only just now realized that, yeah, they have little uh, markings of the UN on their backs. So we gotta, okay, we gotta be close to the path. I gotta get some Marauder tank. United Nations doesn't really do much, guys, come on. Clearly, they are gonna give it to the civilians. And do what? What do you think the civilians, what do you do with that money? What do you guys think they're gonna do? Feed their family? Why feed your family when you can buy tanks? Convoy has entered the region. Come here, Mr. Convoy man. Ooh. Okay. Well, I've missed a couple of shipments, Mr. Civilian man. Okay. I'm gonna park my dudes over here at this intersection. So wait, my mission objective is to get up to what? Twenty thousand. Taking outer supplies, we must stop. What? No! I saw you looking at the supplies, sir! Yeah, take him apart. Take him apart. We will not be oppressed, bro. No cost is too great. I, I can't believe this, honestly. They're trying to steal the stuff we were trying to steal. Our courage will be seen by all. Absolutely. Look how courage I am right now. Our courage will be seen by all. Absolutely. Look how courage I am right now. The culling of Stratholm was a very reasonable thing too, guys. One of the best decisions Art has ever made. Good, 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 good. 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 Hey, 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 lady. Yes, I know. It still run. Find me a fresh site. It still run. Hang on. Yes, I know. It still run. Bro, this guy would suck at Mario Kart. Bloated. Hey, bonus points. You and convoy has been sighted. Find me a fresh site. Okay. Um. Hey, bonus points. You and convoy has been sighted. Okay. Ba -ba -da -da. You gotta be careful with how much I'm enjoying this mission. You and convoy has been sighted. It could be uh, considered weird. I gotta pretend that I don't enjoy it too much. Killed one of my guys. Yeah, yeah, exactly. I gotta make sure I don't enjoy it too much, otherwise I get cancelled. You know, uh, we wouldn't want that. Oh, sorry. Oh, sorry, sorry. Oh. Oh, sorry. Oh, sorry, sorry. Oh, sorry. Oh, sorry. Oh, sorry. 
Sorry, sorry. Oh, sorry, sorry. Sorry. <laughs> Excuse me. Sorry. Oh, sorry. Ooh, jeez. My bad. All right. So I need forty thousand dollars. I like that these guys use American dollars. <laughs> That's pretty funny, actually. Of course they use American dollars. You know that episode where Ron Swanson goes to uh, to London for the first time and he tries to buy stuff using American dollars? I'm getting that vibe right now. Wait, American planes? I have no anti-air. Did these guys shoot? What's good? What? Oh, oh. Water cannon. Villagers have supplies stored in their houses? What is the quad cannon? And them in their homes. Supplies and them in their homes. Quad cannon. Stolen our supplies and secreted them in their homes. Just get our supplies stored in their houses? Oh, for fuck's sake. Oh, for fuck. Fuck. For fuck's sake, 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 we will be protected in there, absolutely. Do you think there's money inside of this guy's home? Oh, see? Thief! Thief! Can't believe they took the supplies of the United Nations and then decided it was theirs. So these guys are supposed to be good when it comes to taking down planes? Yeah, 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 yeah! Excellent, excellent work. Good, 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 good. Good. <sighs> Am I the bad guy? Sometimes I'm getting the vibe that I'm getting the, uh, you know, I'm I'm I'm, I'm kind of a bad guy. No cost is too great though. Okay, we need some more supplies. <laughs> Nearly there. Forty thousand American dollars. Okay. Nearly there. Oh, we already did it? Like the GLA announcer is trying to seduce you? Yeah. 40,000 American dollars. Take down the plane. Yeah, he's, uh, he's, he's uh, you know, trying to seduce you. The voice he uses when he's trying to radicalize the uh, citizens as well. It's you know, kind of nice. Oh my god! These are the new units I got? Our brethren can safely supply We can use this army of the street. Oh my god! These are the new units I got? Our brethren can safely supply Jeez. I get the angry mop. I get a guy with a. Anyways. Got a red plate armor. I played this when I was a kid? Was a kid? This explains a lot. Like you guys see the end result of. Collect forty thousand American dollars. Of course, in a mission where the GLA goes up against the Chinese in the beautiful country of Kazakhstan, we use American dollars. <laughs> I think that's a pretty reasonable thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What else would you use, Loco? I don't know, dude. Yeah, they do a lot of damage. They cut one of the missions? The GLA... Wait, really? They cut a mission from the GLA campaign because it was too messed up? And these did make the cut? That. The game was banned in China. Was well, selecting these units is a bit funky, though, because you have... This is a very reasonable... Uh, this is not the friendliest system for football supporters. Yeah. 
football supporters. So far, are, are destroying their own city, though. They might. This is not the friendliest campaign, no. These people are, are big for football supporters in countries where this was originally banned. Yeah. They're trying to liberate. Yeah. That's, they're the good guys. Oh, oh, whoa, 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 buddy! And I'm the one committing more crimes here, gamers? Wow. They have dragon tanks. I go drag on these nuts and then I, I died. Would be nice if there was something like a hospital or something so I could heal up my troops. Should I be making a base, by the way? I just was supposed to go at $40,000 and that was it. I don't know if I should be building a base. Just like the previous mission, I have to collect 40 grand. I'm already at 33 now. Or something. Like maybe New York. Like posted on a house. Well, maybe in Kasakhtan it is, though. Earn a cash bounty for every enemy unit or building you kill? Wait, I already did the mission? I made no structure! I did nothing! Pretty good. Okay, these mobs were pretty good. These war crimes I've committed so far. These were the easiest war crimes I've committed so far. Yeah, no, we gotta show them liberty. That's what we need to do. Of America will not go unanswered. Or yeah. Keep Turkey from their imperialist grasp. Wow. May our aim be true as we knock their superior air. Go to grid 781 and give us a sip. Buggies. <laughs> There's a thingy over here at the bottom of the map. I can make one of these rocks. Okay, so I brought. Oh, I thought you finished this freaking thing. I will try to hurry. I've tried building those like 17 times now. Oh, there's a. I forgot about them. Wait, are you okay, bud? Kick up some dirt. Are you? Are you okay, buddy? Would you like to try some? There is enough for everybody. There is enough for everybody. Shower anyone? <laughs> no, you idiot. If I see one keg W in the chat, just right away. Right away. Banned from the channel. Right away. No hesitation. <sighs> okay, I'll save it here, I guess. Whoa, 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 whoa. And I'm the one committing war crimes? Holy shit, dude. Holy shit! Holy shit, dude! Freedom, baby! <laughs> More freedom than I'm comfortable with. Okay, I lost a lot of dudes. Oh my lord, okay. This has become a bit of an issue now. I am getting destroyed! There's some money for killing these enemies though. Luckily there is some money for killing them. Okay. I do still have some units left over. Okay. I don't know what the thingy is called. Okay, maybe adding in those toxin tanks is a bit of a gamble. So you, I need you to make a thingy where- There's a thingy over here at the bottom of us. Maybe we should kill that first. I think it'll be fine, dude. Oh, it's a lot easier to play because the units are captured. 
even and <laughs> getting really explosive <laughs> is what it says on the side of the truck. Very nice. Okay, whoever gets there faster. By carrying the warheads. Okay. Oh. Of a crowd. <laughs> yeah, personal. So where exactly do I send it? Right over here, right? So where exactly, where exactly do I send it? Right over here. I love a crowd. Oh my god, it is those. Da <laughs> it's these guys. I love a crowd. <laughs> That's so fucked. So f fucked. That's really messed up. I love that they didn't hold back now. That's so fun. Also a little screwed up. I love a crowd. Ay ay ay. <sighs> Yeah, personally, I don't really mind such things, but I also understand that not everybody feels particularly comfortable with that sort of stuff. With that sort of stuff. So, um, I'm supposed to detonate these these trucks? Do I just do it anywhere? I I guess I guess it goes when I detonate. Was that the way I was supposed to do it? That was a bigger explosion than I thought it was going to be. I'll be honest with you, I did not think that the explosion was going to be... I'll be honest with you, I did not think that the explosion was going to be that large. That's not what she said. No! Well, uh, it looks like the save that I made was... Um, it's a nuke loco? Yeah, but I've seen video game nukes before, guys. Plus, there's nukes in this game that we have already dealt with that weren't quite that large. I still have one. Dude attacking us over I think that nuke may have actually just cost me the game. <laughs> we should pro No, no, no. The, the forces are... Forces in a So I think what I'm doing right now is the face tank approach to a mission where you're supposed to be quite stealthy. I've decided, buddy, but but is up to I much what is much. I don't know what happens though. Does this hit friendlies? You guys are the target. That does hit friendlies. Now, you know, try it. You know, current stealth fighters do 25% heavy armor ready. Billing and stuff. They're all good, yeah. I like this one. No, I like this. is my favorite. I do, Rolf. There's a donation button below the stream in one of the panels. This is a very good mission. You say that with every single one of them, Shikaze. I like. Yeah, they built a freaking castle over here, man. Like, <laughs> well, they probably stole it. I gotta make this is reasonable. I need a strategy. Let's go play this mission. <laughs> you know that is the beauty of old school games. Wait, look, do it, do this. <laughs> Makes it even better. Put up an American flag. We have their building. Yeah. Universe. I don't know if I share electricity. Oh, 
Yes, it's a certainly a bug. This will donate more, it comes up faster. Nice. Thank you, mask caller. Oh, casual. It's video today morning. Actually, test? Yeah. Run a new test. I mean, like 20 minutes. Fine. Hold up. Stop the test. I gotta start a new. Gotta do that that YouTuber th video. I talk about the fact that there's no replays of today. What? Live right now. Publishing this video today. I like how they make it ex army. Yes. Until the fourth is done. Oh. <laughs> yeah. The community. An American. Look, here's an American drink. 30 Days of Darkness is a good movie. It would just be light. I remember a little while ago, whenever. Oh, look, they, ha they have nighttime. They always have volcano. All right, man. Let me know how it goes. All right. Look, you see our new volcano? A new volcano. Look, you see our new volcano? A new volcano right now in Iceland? Bro, you guys always have volcanoes going on. This volcano is called Burbjörn. They gave him a name. Burbjörn, Svartsengi, and Hussefell. These are live streams right now. Oh, look, they, ha they have nighttime again. You oh, look, they, ha they have nighttime again. You guys have nighttime again in Iceland? Sort of. I don't look. It's dark. It's a lot more spectacular during the during the night. I remember a little while ago, whenever uh, Argyle would link me uh, an active volcano in the middle of the summer or whatever, it would just be light around the clock. There would never be nighttime, and in the winter, likewise, very dark the entire time. And you're like, oh, this is depressing. <laughs> that was last year. Yeah. 30 Days of Darkness is a good movie. Hmm. Look, here's an American drink. An American drink. Big Bite Hot Dog Sparkling Water. Big Bite Hot Dog Sparkling Water. What, what am I even looking at? Is this hot dog flavored water? That looks really nasty, dude. I'm not gonna lie. House of Miracles. They did it again. They did it again. Also, guys, very sad observation right now on Twitch. But I hate to break it to you all. Our community guidelines are designed to help Twitch save, blah, blah, blah. Starting on Friday, which is today, content that focuses on intimate body parts for a prolonged period of time will not be allowed anymore. So I have decided to send my transparent chair back to Amazon. The green bikini that I had on, on order, I've cancelled it. We are no longer uh, playing Fortnite on my ass. I know. I know, it's a sad day to be a streamer. But no worries. Twitch is always doing this thing where they are actively responding to what they... What they have come up with, right? The, the, the Let's just say that the community that does these sort of streams, they're very... They're very quick. They're very quick to make adjustments. So I don't really know exactly what they will be doing next. They're very creative, absolutely. Can we go to the just chatting section on Twitch right, right now and see what's going on? Just chatting. Are, are they doing okay? There's... What? This is surprisingly chill, guys. This is all very chill. There's a lot of clothes currently going on here. Like back in my day, right? Back in my day, we would just watch. Po I'm, I'm, no, no, no. We would never have watched. No, 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 no. Sorry. <clears throat> Did it work? To be fair, this is not quite peak hours yet on, on Twitch, okay? We have to wait another two hours or so. And then uh, we will have to recheck this again. But this is surprisingly chill. Yeah, I mean, not all of them. You know what's funny?
like sometimes I scroll through the just chatting section on Twitch and I'm afraid that my stream is gonna be banned. <laughs> like I feel like I scroll through this this freaking website that is and I feel like just me looking at these these thumbnails sometimes would get, you know. <laughs> Fursuit Friday? That is the first time I've heard of Fursuit Friday? That is the first time I've heard of Fursuit Friday. But fair enough. No, this is all... There's a lot of just chatting streamers, dude. It's a very popular category. What about the hot tub section? Uh, pools, hot tubs, and beaches. My favorite... Th this, this, is, this is my favorite pools, hot tub, and beaches. Yeah. This, this, one's, this one's excellent. I love this guy. I love this. I love, I love this monkey primarily because he do, like he, he looks like your average truck driver who's been doing this for many many years, and he still loves it. But he's very comfortable about it, though. You know, he's just kind of like, you know, hand out of the window, kind of cruising. Like he's been doing this for decades. Isn't it also kind of amazing that these apes can actually freaking drive cars? Easy peasy. Look at him. This guy's he's chilling. Look. <laughs> Oh my god, that was a great shot. Touching the touching. <laughs> He's touching the grass too, very nice. Isn't it kind of amazing though? The fact that apes can use tools like this? And so casually. Yeah, he follows the road, he's not gonna hit anything. <laughs> yeah. This guy's gonna- You see that? This guy is gonna boot up some some StarCraft ladder, play some Protoss on the Brute War ladder. If Artosis' stream is to be believed, I think they actually did a bit of a racer on the gas pedal. Did you see that? There was like a racer on the on the gas pedal. Like there was like a like a like a I don't know like a twenty centimeter block. Orangutan ASMR on YouTube. I have never looked for Orangutan ASMR, but I will have to. Orangutan ASMR. Orangutan Freddy tries a few snacks. <laughs> is this guy using a, a spoon to eat cornflakes? Dude, you know what actually, what kind of blows my mind about orangutans? Is like their faces are very, like their eyes and stuff look very human-like, very frequently. Like, you can tell that these guys are fucking intelligent. Tell that these guys are fucking intelligent. Intelligent, like they're they're you know not quite human levels of intel, but they're not dumb. And then at the same time, these guys could literally t tear your arm off. Like they could literally grab your arm and just pull it, and they they, they could just fuck you up in in a heartbeat. <laughs> why is he used? <laughs> why is he? Why is the orangutan using a straw? Oh, he's liking those cornflakes. <laughs> he just threw the glass on the floor. What the heck, man? It looks like they have carpet. I've seen kids do that. I've seen kids. <laughs> Here's Freddy. I like Freddy. Oh, it's the worst vegetable. The thing is, say Freddy flips the table while you're recording a video, right? What do you do? Do you go in there and you, you put the table back up? What if this guy grabs your arm and decides up? What if this guy grabs your arm and decides to rip it off? <laughs> they basically... They basically have four hands. 
<laughs> this guy could be a Twitch streamer. Let's be real here for a second, dude. I have seen streamers do this exact thing in the just chatting section. Yeah, that'd be all. That'd be advertising. Let's be real here for a second, dude. I have seen streamers do this exact thing in the just chatting section. Yeah, that'd be all. That'd be advertising their OnlyFans. Freddy didn't put that shirt on by himself. This is kind. <laughs> I have. This is. This kind. <laughs> I have seen people do that too in the just chatting section. This is kind of like a toddler, except he's incredibly powerful. It it's you know, what if your your four year old, what, what, what if your three year old, whatever, what if your very young child also happens to be able to flip cars, like fully sized ones, you know? Is he eating rice cakes? <laughs> This is a great video. I love this video. <laughs> that was inappropriate, Freddy. I don't actually think that was Freddy. I don't... <laughs> Prince. Prince is a cheat. That's how I usually eat popcorn too. I just scoop it all in my mouth. <laughs> this guy is eating two bell peppers in one bite. <laughs> I like that, yeah. Stuff. I like that. Yeah. Is that the artist formerly known as Prince? I would imagine it's a different one, but. Whoa, do you think he. Whoa, he peeled that apple? Why did they peel the apple for the Oregon? Why the fuck did they peel the. He peeled that apple? Why the fuck did. That they peel the apple for the orangutan. Is this an orangutan with an attitude? It really is like a toddler, yeah. They're pretty animals, though. Look at that. Look at this Giga Chat over here. Freddy? I think I might be Freddy. I don't know. This guy's a bit of a derp. <laughs> a giant ginger? Well, he's an orangutan. What a great video. They look very cuddly here. Can we do like uh, the? Str Can I find like a strength test for an orangutan? There's got to be a an example of how strong an orangutan is somewhere. I have no idea. Well, I can't find it. easy. Two up easy. But I feel like they could mess you up easy. Easy. Orangutan. Orangutan. About five to seven. They can easily lift a dock coaster. I had no idea. Orangutan strength is estimated to be about five to seven times that of a human. Seven times that of a human. They can easily lift up to twice their body weight. Their grip strength is approximately 270 kilograms. That's a lot of grip strength. So these guys don't do any strength training, right? That's kind of the thing. If you could teach an orangutan how to bench press, they would fuck you up really easily. Press, they would fuck you up really They would fuck you up really easily. Don't shake hands with an orangutan. No, don't do that. Unless they're kind of chill about it. But, you know, you could easily squeeze your hand to bits. Yeah, for sure. You see monkeys at the gym all the time? There are some... There are some strong guys at the gym that I go to as well, yeah. You don't trust any animals with thumbs? Look at this, Pig General. Am I making you uncomfortable right now, Pig General? Ooh. Sick, right? Kinda. That was a bit weird. I agree. No orangutans can reach about one and a half meters tall. Females, 1.2 meters. Female orangutans only go upwards of 55 kilos? Really? I thought they'd be heavier. The male orangutans go twice that much. Male orangutans go 93 to 103 kilograms. So they're pretty much humans. Just a bit short, maybe, but... Yeah. <sighs> Alright, Zalmont. 
Calm down, buddy. Probably much stronger. No, 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 not probably. They are definitely much stronger. Hey, how is my new YouTube video doing today? What's my thumbnail doing? I made a title change. Wait, they can have romantic... Oh, cut yesterday. Thumbnail. Win. Oh, sleep. It is time to stop. Is that what I think it is, Mr. One Penguin? Is that a 69 month resup? Nice! 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 Very good. Very good. It's doing better because there are two thumbnails out there against the original one. Maybe you're right. You commented and liked the video. Thank you, Mickey. I appreciate it. Nice! Very good. Very good. You commented and liked the video. Thank you, Mickey. I appreciate it. Uh, I'm gonna go and do a little bit of RimWorld, guys. I put Very nice. ...in the chat, so I feel like I shouldn't really... ...view your classic in a max late game... There. I don't think that's entirely unreasonable. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Is this like a game that runs on a single core? No, I don't have a single core maxing out either. Where's Rumpacera? What are you doing right now? To bed? You think you can go to bed? Me? Um... I'm sorry. This kill box is totally fine. VIPs are worthless now? Take that. But... I... Is that what I literally said? No worries, dude. I already called her. You forgot to call your mom about your new VIP status? I'm assuming my new kill box is totally fine. You forgot to call your mom about your new VIP status? Hey, how is you forgot to call definitely much stronger. You forgot to call your mom about your new VIP status? You mean your VIPness? You mean your VIP penis? You mean your VIP penis? You mean your VIP penis? As I like to call it earlier today. You forgot to call your mom about that? No worries, dude. I already called her. I'll let her know. She knows. She knows. Is that what I literally said? VIPs are worthless now? I did devalue your VIPness, I guess. <laughs> no. I did devalue your VIPness, I guess. I did devalue your VIPness, I guess. I did devalue your VIPness, I guess. No. <laughs> Shug me. I just. Shug me. Shug me. Shug me. VIPs are worthless now? I did devalue your VIPness, I guess. No. <laughs> me. I genuinely did not mean to say VIPness. I meant it to say I meant to say VIP dash N E double -S, S. VIPness. I didn't want to devaluate the VIPness. Ah. No! Slander! Slander! You meant what you said? You said what you meant? Hey, um, so... Rumpus... What are you doing right now? Awake working? Mm-hmm. You're awake working? You're awake working? Mm-hmm. You're working right now? Okay, I don't believe that for a second. You seem to be in chat a whole lot. Sleep here often? Oh, you don't think I want to floor it? That it's 
faster? I think so too. <laughs> they die faster? I think please. There you go. Sniper here. There's no Why counter. Think some... over there it isn't. But now the Scud Storm is gonna activate and MG, wherever that Scud Storm is gonna go. Yeah, now it went into my main. Does this work? Oh my god, I'm life. What you said? You said what you meant? Does this work? Does this work? Oh my god, I'm life. It worked! It freaking worked! Yeah, the audio is gonna be annoying. I think the audio is gonna be a little bit of a miss. How's the quality, guys? It's fine. It's all right. It's not that bad. Okay, so the way I've got this set up. Hmm. Hmm. Did I disconnect? I didn't disconnect. We're back. So that's my main concern. Um, that is my main concern. The fact that I am running, I am running off of Wi-Fi. Yeah, so I don't know. I don't know if, if that is like a, a thing I can, can do. So I can actually plug in a cable. I can actually plug in an internet cable. It's just that I don't currently have a proper connection in this room. Hmm. Oh, snap. First sub of legendary Warhammer streamer low pain low pain. I could buy a really long cable. That is an option. Yeah. Sventilator, thank you. For Welcome to my hand stream. There we go. This is my, my hand stream. There we go. This is my, yeah. I could run a really long cable. That is optional. Yeah, that, that is definitely a thing. I, I want to kind of test. I want to kind of test and see whether or not this works. I wonder, like, I have a door that I closed right here. Okay. So here's what I did. Here's what I did. I opened both doors. <laughs> My Wi-Fi um signal is in the room that i normally stream from and i closed both of the doors do you think it's going to be more stable if i leave both of the doors open we're doing an open door policy today yeah i have a piano i do right over here man do you think it'll make a yeah do you not open the i think the open doors will walls definitely include yeah walls def oh what happens if I shake? <laughs> walls definitely include, yeah, walls def, oh. What happens if I shake? <laughs> what happens if I shake? <laughs> okay, if I shake the desk, everything falls apart. So the way I have this set up right now, you guys wanna see how I have my, my, my phone right here? Can you guys see this? This balancing act. This balancing act is what is holding the camera. It is not great. You think 2.4 gigahertz penetrates walls better than 5 gigahertz? I want my Wi-Fi to penetrate, bro. That's what I want it to do. That's all we really want. Hey, so how is how is the internet now? Are we stable? Do we have any real issues? But I'm telling you guys, the door makes all the day now. Is it okay now? Dude, I'm telling you guys, the door makes all the difference. older
I look older. I look older than five minutes ago. Maybe I should turn off the light. There we go. Do I look younger again now? I age very rapidly. Make me look older? I don't know, guys. Camera quality adds 10 years. Okay, let me get my water bottle. I have no idea what sort of Wi-Fi I have, guys. I uh, have Wi-Fi that the internet man installed. Yes, that is what I have. I don't know. Okay. I also don't really know exactly how good the audio is. Is it okay? Like, is the audio... Those are... So I put a rug in here, a rug that we weren't using anymore. The audio is really good. Wait, it is? It's fine? I don't see anybody... Like, is the audio all right? I don't really know exactly... I don't know. Uh, secondly, I also don't really know exactly how good the audio is. Is it okay? Like, is the audio all right? I don't see anybody complain. It's fine. The audio is really good. Wait, it is? I put a rug in here, a rug that we weren't using anymore. I guess I can show you guys this room. Hold on. I put a rug in here. Those are, those are cat toys. I put a rug in here, which I think reduced the echo quite a bit. Um, this is where we usually dry our clothes, because obviously we hang dry our clothes, because we're not, you know, crazy. I have a bookcase over there. It's not very exciting. No, it's a very empty room. Anyways, uh, and then lastly, am I do uh, And then lastly, am I doxing myself? Maybe I shouldn't dox myself. Lastly, um, what was I gonna say? Also, yeah, this is a standing desk. So I don't know how good a standing desk um, is really going to be for streaming. I live in the Netherlands. Is really going to be for streaming? I live in the Netherlands, I do, yeah. It's very slight echo, but nothing to complain to a new streamer until you can afford real equipment. Okay. Yeah, this is like our spare room, uh, Formless Void. We, uh, we don't really use this room all too much. We usually just use it for laundry and like, um, you know, hobby stuff. If I ever have kids or whatever, it might transform it to another room. But as it is right now, it's pretty chill. This is the baby room. No, nah, I mean, the audio is very, it's very for me. You might get something for the iPhone so it doesn't fall off. Okay. Yeah, yeah. So this is my phone. Okay. So, uh, oh yeah. One more problem another another issue that i may run into so like i said i'm doing this on my phone however i'm not sure if my phone while it's charging can charge fast enough for it to not run out of battery no guys we're gonna close the door see if it works apparently i'm being very loud um i need a 45 watt charger yeah i don't know dude i should check what my battery is currently at Hold up. I should check what my battery is current. I should check what my battery is currently at. Hold up. It's currently at 100%. Okay, my battery is currently at 100%. So if my battery is at 100%, test, I guess. And we can test, I guess, and see if it works. Even if it discharges very slowly, it should be okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Actually, it's stable. It's good. Hmm. Give Mrs. Loco earplugs. I did actually. <laughs> Uh, noise cancelling. You know I'm gonna test something and see if it works. I am fairly sure. I'm gonna test. Be sure to add this to your loco setup page. iPhone quality is actually great. Did not expect that. Okay. Be sure to add this to your loco setup page. You know the craziest thing about this? I'm gonna test something and see if it works. I am fairly sure I can disconnect my phone's cable. Yeah, it takes it. Look at this fucking magic. Yeah, it takes it. Look at this fucking. Magic. How does this work? How can. How does that work? I don't even understand. I can, hold up, I wanna see how far I can go. 
It's just that I don't see this train. I'm gonna... Okay, okay, I'll be back. Well, I guess I'm taking you guys with me. This... Does this still work? I have no idea. This is usually where I stream. That's Lenny, right there. I don't have the ch I don't have the chat up. I don't have the chat up. Did that work? That's crazy. It's like three meters? Well, that's true. Who plays the piano? Me, poorly. Go downstairs? I don't know if I want to go that far. Hmm. There you go. This is the area you guys have never seen before. Never seen before footage. Crazy. Yeah, that's the piano. <sighs> so I wonder, I could turn this into a sitting setup. Oh my God. Does this break stuff? I am surprisingly, or I'm actually kind of surprised with how well this has been working. Yeah. Okay. All right. I think you should be able to hear the donations on your phone. Uh, I actually should have it like the top of the desk and I can. So it's like this. I got this light a little while ago after a bunch of people recommended it. So it's like a light that recommended it. So it's like a light that, so it's like this. Um, it's a light that like connects to the top of the desk and I can like turn. Um, it's a light that like connects to the top of the desk and I can like turn it off like this. I can change like the color intensity or the light intensity, I guess, which is really nice for painting. You must have that. It is from a brand called Neatfy, I think. No, 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 no. This, this lamp was definitely not that expensive, Utopia. Yeah, it's really good. I'm actually kind of like waiting until shit goes horribly wrong. Hello, man. So this is what I wanted to build, guys. Square foot, like 1300. Okay, so. This is what I wanted to build, guys. This is a new model that they came out with recently. It is by far the biggest model, even though it's a miniature, um, that I have ever had. And I figured maybe I can build it on stream. I don't know about painting it on stream. I also don't know how good I am at actually putting this together. I feel like it's gonna be a bit of a mess. Look, that's not even twice the size of my flat. There you go, dude, I'm sorry. That's gonna be a bastard to paint with all the texture. Probably, you're probably. Um, so for those of you unfamiliar, the way that these things work is they come like this. So I actually have to glue them together. I will do sub assemblies for this because otherwise I don't think it's really gonna be. Um, so you get these, these screws and then you basically have to put them together kind of like, like an Ikea thing. Let me set up a timer. Where's the paint vibrator? The paint vibrator is over here. Where's the paint vibrator? The paint vibrator is over here. Um, Laurent made fun of the paint vibrator when I first got it. So here's the way it works. Okay, say for example, I wanna check up this paint, right? I can take the vibrator like so, and just push the paint down. And let's push the paint down. And let's push the paint down. It's really nice. I bought it from Alibaba for like 20 bucks. It was really good. It's straight from China. Yeah. Um, it just, it definitely does look a little bit fancy. Yeah. Yeah, no, this is straight from AliExpress. Yeah. It's actually quite good though. It just kind of looks like I have something that should not, you know. So this is... So this is actually meant, I think, to mix up, like, medicine or something? Or at least that's the original intention. And, like, uh, people use it for mini and also for, like, I don't know, like, tattooing ink and stuff. Yeah. Usheron is one of the older vampire counts from the early days? I have no idea, dude. So this is Age of Sigmar. I don't really know anything about the game itself, but I like painting the models. Yeah, basically it creates like a vortex on the inside of it, Pete. 
is we gotta find the parts. So, so for step one, step one A, we gotta find parts six, seven, and eight, which is gonna be his leg. And we gotta try and put that together. That's it, man. I don't know if I can play music, by the way. I think I'm not gonna do How do you know where this eight is? I don't know if there's any. Yeah, I do want to be a bit careful though, because I don't want to fix Well, in Dutch, we would call this. Uh, by the way, I have my Twitch statistics button right over here. Twitch statistics. That would be great, guys. What do I call it? Well, in Dutch, we would call this uh, deep end. We can give you the constant chat count. That'd be great, guys. No, I think I can actually add. We can give you the constant chat count. That'd be great, guys. No, I think I can actually add that to my stream. 420. Twitch statistics. Oh, here we go. I have my Twitch statistics button right over here. Look. Right over there, dude. This is what you look like, by the way. Wave hi to mom. She's watching. She texted me. Or No, no, no. That's inappropriate. You look great. You do look great, Rumpus. Okay, um, so usually the build order is to try and tidy these sort of things up a little bit. So like, for example, I don't know if you can see. Um, can you see that? I should probably focus. How do I do this? Focus. You can kind of see the, the cut and like, sometimes like you can see the, the line where the stuff got connected from the malts that they use, but it's, um, yeah, the little nubs. So I have, I have like a, a hobby knife over here and then I also have some, whatever you call these, like files, I guess. So before we paint it together or we, we put it together, we gotta make sure that all of these parts are actually good. Look out, he's got a knife. Yeah, it's like a scalpel. It's basically a scalpel. So, you know, maybe I uh, won't be painting today, but I might actually have to clip my nails. Wait, what? Are you guys fucking backseat nail? What's wrong with my nails, chat? Are my nails too long? Are you fucking backseat nailing me right now? As well, I guess. Like little. That's cheating. Let's even fucking see what I'm doing. So it will kind of turn into a sellout bar. Do that. Can't you get there? It'd be a shame if I just got a bill the other day for it. It's really nice, dude. Always lovely. Where the government is like, yo, nice, nice sub count you got there. If it'd be a shame if something were to happen to it. And I got parts done. To hold it for. I haven't actually had this happen before. So I burned it on both sides. I hope I didn't go too long, dude. It's a giveaway. Wait, there's a bunny. I'll be back again in a second. I don't think I want to point the laser. Oh, I do it like somewhat. You can probably also find the inside. Okay. Got a bit of paint or a bit of glue. <laughs> 11 clips have been made during today's stream. Hey, has the internet been stable though? So because in the first 30 seconds that I went live on this stream over here on this laptop, I disconnected the next part. It's part one and two. <laughs> Thanks, man. A particular category on Phoenix and the prisoner of past. I kind of figured that that would be the biggest complaint, but I don't see anybody complaining. Hello. I still got into trouble because apparently they were only like a partial owner of their own music because the record label. Your name is Bolt. You're bound to be fucking fast. Hey. Do a thumbs up. My theory holds for sure. Theory holds. Do a thumbs up. 
You have thumbs down on your Mac. We can see. What if you're, what if you're an engine? And that's, I guess, when people pick last names. Doesn't say bro for yeah, what if my name was You work with someone whose last name was And that's I guess when people pick last names. Doesn't sound very free for the American last name. I learned in North American school that last names came from your occupation and career that you had at the time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know what the origins for um for the American last names is. Napoleon who was like, "Yo, guys, you should do things the normal way and use, you know, standard measurements and last names and have your numbers for your houses standardized and all that shit. Standardized and all that shit. And that's, I guess, when people pick last names. Doesn't sound very free to you. No, no, he was, uh, you know, he made himself emperor, so. You work with someone whose last name was engineer and they were an engineer? You just gotta do it just for the gag, even if you don't like engineering, right? Even if you're gonna waste your entire life doing something you hate. If your last name is engineer, you gotta be an engineer. I don't make the rules. Maybe I should be glad my last name has nothing to do with beer. Yeah, what if my name was Heineke? Maybe I'd be an alcoholist, you know, not be ideal. Yeah. What if you're, what if you're an engineer who became an architect? That'd be embarrassing. Imagine you have a meeting with an architect whose last name is engineer. Did that guy fail or succeed? People wouldn't make fun of it for sure. You know, a urologist and his last name is little John. You're not kidding. I'm telling you, man, my theory holds strong. Do a thumbs up. What? You have thumbs down on your Mac. We can see. I have what? Wait, what? Did, did an animation show up on stream? What the fuck is this? What the fuck? What the fuck? Fuck. <laughs> oh no! What is this? <laughs> what the fuck is this? <laughs> oh no! What the fuck is this? I I don't like this. No. I'm streaming from a Mac. Does that work? It's a mech feature? It doesn't work. I was wondering why you guys said thumbs up. I was, dude, you guys pointed out the other day, right? Like this is like a week ago. You guys pointed out that my thumbs are... Ah. We're good? Hello? Are we back? I accidentally paused the recording on my phone. Somebody said on stream the other day, and I can't not see this anymore now. Somebody said on stream that my thumbs are very long. Are my thumbs fucking long or what? They look... Are my thumbs fucking... Are my thumbs fucking... Long or what? They look huge, bro. Why do my why does the fuck does my thumb look so long? Why do my why does the fuck does my the fuck does my, does my thumb look so long? <laughs> I've got huge thumbs, man. Yeah. You know what that means, right? You know what that means? Big gloves. Yeah. I need to get large gloves. Yeah. I have pretty large hands usually, yeah. I, um, I don't know, long thumb, long jaw, that's how it goes. That extra inch went to the thumb. <laughs> God could have put the extra inch anywhere. Decided to put it on the fucking thumb. 
decided to put it on the fucking thumb. God could have put the extra inch anywhere. Decided to put it on the fucking thumb. Uh, come on, man. Uh, come on, man. My character creation screen was randomized too many times. God was just smashing randomize. Ended up with long thumbs. Embarrassing. That's why you have short thumbs? Yeah, sure. Should have rerolled? Some, some people believe you can reroll. I don't think so, though. Double thumbs up? Does that work? Whoa! What the fuck is this? The fuck is Oh, what the f fuck is Whoa! What the f is this? That's actually kind of sick. Awesome! Wait, what else do they have? A peace sign? That's peace, right? Hey, there it is. Oh my god. What the heck? Dude, look look at the look at the camera over there though. The small camera? Some of the balloons are behind me. Like there's actual processing going on here. You see see how they actually are doing life? That's wild. Can I do this on the mainstream? I could, but I would have to um I would have to switch to streaming from a mech, which I don't think I want to do. It's fine for streams like this, but... By the way, how's my phone battery doing? Yeah, my phone battery is discharging slowly. Maybe it's because my screen is on, though. Hold up, I'm gonna try and lock the screen. Okay, I locked the screen. Is that... Is that okay? I think it's... So now the screen is black. Okay. What other... What other things can I do? I should, by the way, attach one of these parts again. Number four is apparently a part of his... This part of the back. What is this? or something. I feel like I'm really dumb. Yeah. I, feel like that's I don't know if you guys can see the whole part. This, this is plastic. This is at the bottom. Bit of glue over here. Okay. What else can I do? Double thumbs down also works? Can I do double thumbs down also works? Can you click links that aren't from Thort? I'm scared of clicking links, dude. Before you know it, you're gonna have a fucking tattoo around. Before you know it, you're gonna have a fucking have a fucking you're gonna have a fucking tattoo around somebody's uh belly button for example is the chat being very quiet or are we okay no sometimes you guys get very quiet and i think i have stream disconnection we're getting somewhere no i'm just kidding thor i'm just it was actually a really funny video. No, I'm just kidding, Thor. I'm just kidding. You didn't post any link. I know. It was actually a really funny video. I checked the video again after the stream. It was actually a really good video that Thor linked at the time. It just threw me way off because I looked at it and I thought I saw it. Anyways, it was actually a great video. Um, oh, I don't know, bro. I'm scared of touching the uh, mecha. Okay, so we have a couple of things. We have hearts. I feel like the hearts don't really work very well. Maybe I should do that one instead. Does it work over there? Yeah, it does work over here. Okay. Double thumbs down. Double thumbs down. Wait. Oh, no, it just did one over here. I think I have to see both of my hands. Hey, there it is. Everybody knows that rain is double thumbs down. To show lasers, make signs of horns with both your hands? Oh, it works over there. Oh, shit, dude. Oh, it works over there. Oh, shit. Shit, dude. Dude. <laughs> Okay, double thumbs up is easy. That one's kind of cool too. The double thumbs up seems very reliable. Yeah, it works so smoothly though. You know what's crazy, dude? So I got this laptop like two years ago, right? 
It, no, I think maybe a year and a half or so ago. It's the M2 MacBook Air. I really like this laptop. I know not everybody is a fan of Apple products and that's fine. But this laptop for some reason doesn't have a fan. Like it, it, there's no fan in there. It doesn't get hot. And I'm streaming from it while running multiple cameras and doing all this shit and it's totally fine. Like why is it, to why is it so easy? It's using 5.6% fan in there. It doesn't get hot. I'm streaming from it while running multiple cameras and doing all this shit and it's totally doing all this shit doing all this shit doing all this shit and it's totally fine. Like why is it to why is it so easy? It's using 5.6% of the processor right now using 254 megabytes of RAM to run this stream. That's nutty. It's completely silent. Like I actually, the, the, the efficiency is nuts. Yeah, not to turn into an Apple fanboy, but they really, like the amount of power draw that I got from my PC is, is like literally like 20 times this. It's crazy. The hardware is actually so efficient. Yeah. I actually didn't think I was gonna be able to stream comfortably on this and I'm using like five to 6% of my processor. I wonder what happens if I do this. Does it use significantly more? Yeah, 6.6. .6. It does push my processor use up about 2%. <laughs> All right, fair enough. You just wish there wasn't an Apple markup on the hardware? Yeah. I think this laptop is gonna last me a long time though. What I do like about Apple products is that like this laptop is still going to even in like, you know, if I sell it in like four years, I can still sell it. Kind of difficult to do. I found like I tried doing that with a windows laptop I had and nobody wanted to buy it. <laughs> nobody wanted to buy it. What happens when you do fireworks and lasers at the same time? Mm. You think my voice sounds nicer like this thought? I sound more human. Really? I have a bit of processing on my main mic, that's true. Do I sound substantially different? I could probably sell it online for a bit more than that, Bunny, but yeah. I sound more lively on my, wait, I sound more lively here? I sound better here? What? Bro, I'm using my phone. This is literally my phone's microphone. It's definitely more echoey here because I have no sound deadening. It, it should definitely sound worse, yeah. You sound human and not as perfectly plastic. Ooh. Are you calling me Barbie, Maktavas? Dude, I always wanted to be Barbie. Okay, uh, that's section number five. It's so hard to see. So wh where does section five come from? on my computer? And because of that, I sound too good on my computer. And because of that, it sounds like I'm less human. Use a little bit more. It's a fang maybe. You guys are saying I sound too good on my computer and because of that, it sounds like I'm less human. That is hilarious. The sound is too clean. Luckily you inspired me to build the metal earth models. Oh, sick dude. Bro, I need to, I need to not like, I'm not going to do it like this anymore. I'm not fucking, I'm, I'm moving the books first and foremost anymore. I'm not fucking, I'm, I'm not fucking, I'm Look what you inspired me to build. Oh, sick, dude. Sick, dude.
Bro, I need to- I need to not, like, I'm not gonna do it like this anymore. I'm not- I'm- I'm moving the books, first and foremost. And I'm gonna find, like, assuming I wanna do this again in the- assuming I wanna do this again in the future, I'm gonna find a tripod. This is too dangerous. Yeah, I need a stand for this. This is very sketchy, dude. At you. Just move it a few degrees to the front so the angle is more at you. I can definitely turn it a little bit. That's no problem. I just don't really wanna... Like, I mean moving forward. Assuming I wanna do another stream from here. Which I probably will. I'm kinda enjoying this. I don't know about you guys, but... Um... I would like to. One of his toes is messed up, man. I don't know. It's kind of like a just chatting stream, really. Yo, Dialan, what's up, man? Yes, dragging the average skill level in this Twitch category down. people use? You have a Python? You have that any tidier than that, right? But what do people do that do like competitions and stuff? They don't have focus. What sell like competition? Later. I think you may have mentioned tiny gaps and then send it. very small. What do you hear? Yeah, I think it's the last part I'm blowing on chat. Yeah, I should definitely have my camera angle a little different. I'll just basically copy Germany. Although from a flat image, but I know you will judge that I'm rich. Alright, Rex. Alrighty, Rex Star. Never have a poll of the day. See you guys. Never had a streamer very easily. This is my only way. April Fools doing a long stream. Gotcha, bro. Just, yeah, just, I should go live one hour earlier on Monday. Just to go to, if you go to, uh, the clock is moving one hour for me. Just, yeah, just, yeah, yeah, yeah. I can't really be a, really, uh, really gonna so rich from YouTube money. Okay, all right. Loco is so rich from YouTube money. Okay, all right, right, next door. Rexor is telling me that I am rich? Alright, Rex. Alrighty, Rexor. Never have I seen a more fashionable man around Krefeld than when Rexor visited. Pretty sure Rexor's coat could buy half the city. <laughs> Guys, it's been a fantastic stream. Hope you enjoyed hanging out here today. Dude, he did have a nice coat. Yeah, Thor does it. Or, sorry, Rexor does have a nice coat. Yeah, yeah. It looked very comfortable. Anyways. Guys, thank you very much for being here. Hope you enjoyed hanging out. I'll be back again on... Oh, I don't have an end stream scene over here. So instead I'm gonna be the... Yeah, I'm gonna be doing that awkward thing where I just click the end stream button. And then the stream just disappears. Now, that's, that's what we're gonna do. There's no... You just have to imagine your name scrolling across the screen right now. But I can maybe do this. And then call it a day. See you guys. Bye! I went to the bonsai place this morning. I went to the bonsai place.